If you only have one hour to learn Next.js, then this is the video for you. If you're new here, hi, my name is Zoe. I'm a software engineer and former university professor that loves teaching folks how to code. Today, we're gonna learn Next.js in one hour by building this web app. Let's get started. All right, so what we're gonna be building here is just a really straightforward sort of single page application um, that basically is gonna display a bunch of planets and some data about each of them. So pretty straightforward. If you do wanna follow along with this, <clears throat> this is a design I got from Front End Mentor. Um, they have a ton of great designs. This is one of their premium designs, so you do have to pay to get all the assets. Um, but uh, if you wanna follow along, definitely think it's worth the subscription if you can afford it. So what we're gonna do first, I'm gonna head over to Next.js and I'm just gonna go into their documentation and see what um, their installation process is because usually um, they have pretty good documentation. So I'm gonna head over to the side here in the installation. There are two ways to install this, but because we're trying to do this quickly, we're gonna use their automatic installation. So what that means is we're gonna access this um, package called create next app. So I'm just gonna copy this command here. I'm gonna head over, I have a terminal window open here and I'm just gonna go ahead and create that. <clears throat> so it's gonna say uh, npx create next app at latest. And I'm also just gonna give it a name. Um, so you can do that by just putting a space and typing in the name there. So I'm gonna say planet facts site. I'm gonna create that. And then it's gonna ask me a whole bunch of starter questions. So first one, do I wanna use TypeScript? Yes. Do I wanna use ESLint? Yes. Do I wanna use Tailwind CSS? I'm gonna say no for this project because I'm gonna actually install Material UI, um, but feel free to use it if you'd prefer to. Um, it automatically selected no for me. Um, and you'll see that it kind of bounces between no and yes, depending on what they recommend. Um, so for this one, they said no. Um, would you like your code inside a source directory? No, app router, yes. App router is the new router or the newish router um, compared to the pages router, which is an older router that they support. Um, would definitely recommend using app router. I think it's a bit more performant than pages router. Um, so I'm gonna use that. I'm not gonna use Turbo Pack and I'm not gonna customize the alias. 